Hi, welcome back to my channel. As always, thanks to those of you who have subscribed and for those who haven't yet, take a moment to click the subscribe button. I have lots of great content coming up and uh, you don't want to miss it. So today we have an interesting one. Um, what we have, and we'll go over each one separately, are two, uh, not Lego, but a, a made in China, Major League Baseball licensed building block kits. Pardon the boxes are a little beat up. I've had them for a while, but I figured I'd build them, review them for you guys. Um, so, so the brand seems to be BR, it looks like XLZ. Uh, yes, I'm a Mets fan. Um, so this one is Mr. Met. You can see they are officially licensed by the MLB. It looks like it has some cool custom tiles on the bottom, which we'll get to. It is 708 pieces. Um, so this is this side. The other side displays it horizontally. Um, so it looks cool. Let's see what's inside uh, the box. So we've got one bag of... They are, they are mini... So there are many Lego bricks. There are many very, very small bricks. This is going to be challenging. I've never built a miniature one. As you can see, they're very tiny. So I've never done this before. Here we go. These look, I will say, the pieces that are in here look much more red than orange. So we'll see. Here's the base. You can see there it's very small. And we have an instruction booklet. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, so it looks fairly straightforward. I mean, it looks like it'll be easy enough to follow. But like I said, these pieces do not look orange. They definitely look red. I mean, I don't know how the camera's picking them up, but they look red. So we'll see. We'll attempt to put it together, and we will see what, what it looks like. So let's put this back in the box, and we'll open the other set up. So the other set is larger. Uh, this is the horizontal view. Here is the vertical view. It is uh, 1,197 pieces. Um, this box is a little more beat up. But let's see what this one looks like. Hopefully the pieces are more orange. They look like they are. So we have a bag here. Yeah, these look orange. These pieces are orange. So the hat looks like it would be better. But we'll see, again, we'll see when we put them together. Another bag of a lot of blue. And for some reason, a bag with several, what is it, six pieces in it, which I don't understand, but okay. And then, again, the book. And this book, similarly, looks like it's similar to a Lego book. What's neat is it looks like it's going to do it in layers, and only the current layer you're working on is in color. So that's kind of interesting. That'll help. With the build process so they look pretty cool um i'm not too sure about the mr met again those pieces do not look orange to me to my eye they look red we'll see when i get going on it um so i'm gonna build them and uh we'll get back and see the finished product when we're done so stay tuned okay so we've got these two kits built um i have a lot to talk about first of all the tiny bricks are a pain. They are not easy to build. This is not, I would not recommend this for our young children. It was very difficult. Um, let's start with the Mr. Met. So there were pieces that, if you remember, I said were looked red, not orange. Well, they were, but they're supposed to be. They were the stitching, you know, in his head, which is supposed to be a baseball. So as you can see, he came out pretty good. I mean, I'm happy. Um, there are some pre-printed bricks, which is really kind of cool. Okay, Mr. Met, the NY and the Mets. So the only problem, as you probably are noticing, if I show you the picture of what he's supposed to look like, I'm missing the decals. So there was supposed to be a Mets on his chest and an NY on his hat, and I don't have either of those decals. Um, the parts are here, but no decals. I searched everywhere. They're not in the book. They were not here. So what I will probably do is cut out some pictures out of here and use double-sided tape and make the decals because overall it is a cool and a cool build a model. 
came with a lot of extra pieces. Not that I'm ever going to use them, frankly, because they're little tiny bricks, which again were so difficult. Uh, this one was not super difficult, was not as difficult as the next one, which I'll show you. Um, but it's cool. It looks like Mr. Met. I just need the decals. Okay, so that's that one. The baseball helmet. Wow. So it's finished. It looks, I think it looks pretty great. I mean, this did have its decal, this one. Um, I mean, this looks, I think it looks really great. I mean, it, it's, it looks just like a batting helmet. It's, it's, you can tell it's an NY. I mean, and it's orange. It's, I like it. But this one was nearly impossible. I had to restart it three times because it's a lot of, I don't know how much you've, you, if you've built these where you're laying things flat and then the next layer has to go on it. But the ones you lay flat, especially with tiny bricks, they move and, and, and it's just incredibly difficult um, to do. Um, this one also had a ton of extra pieces. Again, I'm not going to use them because I don't want to build anything with these. This is just going to be for a display. Um, the other problem with this one was in the book where you're looking, it's dark blue and it's hard to see which pieces they are. I mean, I had to use like the camera and zoom in and magnify. It was difficult. And it did come with this little tiny, you know, brick removal tool, which I did use because I made a lot of mistakes. So overall, I mean, they're cool models. I'm happy that they look cool. This one, I need the decals, but still the printed bricks are cool. This one looks great. I mean, as is, it's nice, um, but difficult to build. But if you're looking for a challenge, I mean, I know they make these for all different teams. I bought them at the stadium, but I'm sure every stadium sells them. Um, so just make sure you get the decals, um, but they're cool. But again, it's for an advanced builder. I would not recommend these for anyone young because they're very, very difficult. So all in all, that's it. Um, I don't know. Let me know your opinion in the comments. What do you think? Do you think they look good? Um, you know, have you ever built anything with the small bricks? Let me know what your experience is. Um, other than that, thanks everyone who has subscribed. And please, if you haven't, consider subscribing because uh, I've got a lot more great content and great videos planned. Uh, lots of new stuff coming up. So thank you and I'll see you next time.